I told you, SEC is not playing around. Things are moving forward. SEC has collected thousands of staff messages used on private devices from more than a dozen major investment firms. Who are these firms? One of your favorites, of course. Carlisle, Apollo, KKR, TPG, Blackstone and Citadel. This is per Reuters. And guys, this is not occasional event. This is part of a major probe from the SEC. Look at this. The SEC has collected thousands of staff messages for more than a dozen companies, escalating its probe into Wall Street's use of private messaging apps. Previously, SEC has asked companies to internally review the messages in its investigation of Wall Street using WhatsApp, Signal and other unapproved messaging apps to discuss work. The two-year crackdown into potential breaches of record-keeping rules initially targeted broker-dealers, netting regulators over $2 billion in fines. Well, I guess now it's time to, to up of these particular prices because they're going after different big boys on Wall Street. While Reuters and other media have reported that the SEC's off-channel communication probe has expanded to investment advisors, its move to review thousands of their staff messages has previously been reported. What the heck this actually means? Well, employees of these big investment firms, hedge funds, advisories, they simply, instead of using, you know, your company's email, company's communication systems, they simply, you know, download the WhatsApp or some of these other incognito messaging or communication apps. They use them, no one knows what they actually share. You know, some of these apps have the functionality to simply delete the messages automatically after the other party receives the message. Read the message and the message simply is gone. Why would they use a messaging app that could simply, you know, make the, 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 the whole communication channel disappears after the, the message has been delivered, right? Interesting. So this particular move from the ACC, it's in contrast to the broker-dealer probe. In those cases, the ACC asked companies to review staff messages to report how many of these people actually discussed work. So far, so good. ACC has only reviewed only a couple of these messages. Like I mentioned, a lot of messages, in my opinion, especially using the WhatsApp and functionality, might have been gone forever. The messages that they were able and capable to review and restore, uh, we're going to be waiting to see what they actually found out and what they read about over there. The sources spoke to the condition of anonymity because the SEC investigations are confidential. At least 16 of these forms. Just think about it. This coming uh, days after, you know, remember what happened with two of the biggest boys on Wall Street for mismarking securities, right? Like I said, SEC looks like it's on a roll. Is it because, you know, filling the gaps in the budgets and trying to, you know, collect as much as uh, premiums by, you know, imposing fines here and there? I don't know. Or it is simply, uh, you know, trying to clean the market forever. And as always... A spokesman for Citadel declined to comment. And as a ritual as well, a spokesman from the SEC also declined to comment. Chair Gary Gensler has defended the communication scrutiny, saying record-keeping rules are critical in helping SEC guard against wrongdoing. And I will tell you why I believe SEC is so freaking smart. Because look at what the lawyers are saying. Why is this whole probe about? This the whole probe about might not actually be for the messaging app. They're after something else. Look at this. Now that the SEC have all the data, right? It is very possible that the SEC will find compliance failures in there somewhere and have nothing to do with the off-channel communication record keeping issues. Meaning, right, if the SEC want to investigate something else, some other part of the business, but they simply don't have enough evidence, so you cannot start investigation. You probably cannot even access or request access to particular files. But guess what? If they find that some other part of the business, you know, has something that is not according to the you know rules and regulations, they can request access to it. In this particular case, the off channel messaging app, they can gather evidences and information to build up completely different probes, which makes so much sense. This is why I said that if that's the case, SEC, it's very, very smart. You understand how they're actually going to gather and going to investigate and, you know, uh, simply build up completely different cases if they have enough 
sufficient data that back their, you know, uh, speculative uh, assumption about the market. And, and these participants, right, we're having about 16 firms. It's not just one firm. And, you know, they were going to gather a lot of information. And the most important part, they're not going to just gather what each firm, you know, ha have uh, sent as a message, but they're also going to gather uh, in between communication channels. So it's not like company client, right? You will have companies as a B2B communication channels as well, potentially. This is why this is very, very bullish. Yeah.